go. Alright guys, um, I'm recording this on my old cell phone, literally my old cell phone. Uh, it's kind of late for the paranormal shit to be happening in my house. It's literally almost 5 o'clock in the morning. So you guys need to let these whatever the fuck is in my house know that it's kind of late because quite literally my bedroom door I kind of I opened my eyes right whenever that door was literally being opened and slammed shut along with my bathroom door um I heard it slammed shut too um we always keep that door open especially in the winter time because um, for some reason, there is not a heater vent in my hallway, and that door, um, yeah, there's a vent in the bathroom, and we keep that door open to basically heat the hallway up, so, yeah. But yeah, like I said, it, it slammed shut completely. Woke me up. My fiance is still sound asleep. I have no idea how the hell she's still sleeping. But it scared the living shit out of me. So I'm going to see what the hell's going on. Whoops. Okay. I am in the mirror room. I set the, uh, uh, the little heater up last night because it was cold. It's always cold in this room in the winter time because of those windows. Um, I'm not sure, but I kind of think that's why this mirror happens to thrive really good in this room because um, the paranormal is said to really like. What the hell's going on with my phone? My old phone. It's like. The screen is acting really, really weird. I don't understand that. But anyways, yeah, I think that's the reason why this... The mirror thrives so good in this bedroom. is because it's always cold in here. And the paranormal is said to love the cold. Um, so, what I'm going to do is if that's not too hot. Actually, I think I may have shut it off last night. I really don't remember... But if it's not too warm, I'm going to tape my, you know, this up to it again. And I'm gonna. I got my other cell phone, my my new cell phone with me, and I'm going to record for a little bit. Um, again, it's like five o'clock in the morning, and this shit woke me up. So I'm a little bit pissed off, but just sit tight. I gotta set everything up. Use it. That. Turn that off.
Okay, I got my drink. Um, <clears throat> before, actually, literally, whenever I turn my phone on, this goes to about on on my phone. Uh, something said I'm lost, and then something said threat. I don't know what that means. I don't know who's lost, but we're gonna find out. I hope. Okay, got my drink. Sorry, there's cars going down the road as we speak right now. Uh, the factory that's by my house that I used to work at, they're uh, letting, you know, it's, it's their time to, for people to uh, start leaving work for, you know, the people that work the later shifts. Unless they're actually working 10s. They might be working 10s now. I don't know. But anyways, who slammed my doors? And why did you slam my doors and wake me up? Who? Who? Yeah, that's what I want to know. Who? Who opened up and slammed my doors? Since you're opening up doors and slamming them, can you fully open my bathroom door and then slam it? Or don't slam it, just kindly shut it. I still don't know how the hell my fiance slept through that. I have no idea. She always says that she's a very light sleeper and she's not. Half of the time you can set a bomb off beside her head and she can't wake and she will not wake up, I promise you. Come on, open that door. Open the door more.
crazy. I literally almost have the entire room covered with cameras. Actually, if I would set another camera up over there, I would have the entire room covered. But I'm not going to set my phone up over there. Because I just don't fucking want to. Who, who are you? What is your name? I should actually set this down somewhere and grab somebody because I'm fucking hungry. I feel like I'm gonna pass out, but I don't know why. <laughs> Can you tell me your name? Watch this back. It kind of looked like there was a almost like a dark shadow at the very top of the, the very top of the door. I gotta watch this back. I don't know if it's just my eyes playing tricks on me or not. Literally, the room is just illuminated by cell phone light. That's it. If I turn my cell phone lights off, it's like, look, that's one cell phone light off right now. And it's practically fucking black in this room. So. Doctor. Doctor. The doctor please stay. For all you horror fans out there, that's off of uh House on Haunted Hill, the remake. It might have been in the original too. I can't really remember. It's been it's been like fucking almost twenty years since I've seen the original. I'm thirty one, so yeah, I seen the original when I was like ten. Can you move the Ouija board? Since you don't want to talk to me, you slammed my doors. And now you don't want to fucking do anything with me. Good, move the planchette. It's there. It's there for you, to, for you to use. You can literally use it to talk to me.
Lady. Lady. What lady? Again, guys, I don't know if this ghost tube app works or not. Um, I mean, I, I had to pay, it was like $12 or something like that. My ear's ringing like crazy right now. But I had to pay like $12 for it. So, I mean, either it works or they are like tricking people into buying their product which is smart hello hello gregory gregory is that who slammed my door is that who's out in my kitchen right now something out the kitchen. I thought I was going to be on save, but Ooh, I already let me out there. I feel like a ghost. Can't see anything. Whatever I'm doing.
so that was really weird. I heard. When I came back in here, I heard something. It sounded like something was messing with the tree. I think it sounded like something knocked a... Like it was kind of like went like this or something to a tree limb on the on the tree and then it sounded like a bulb hit the floor. So I don't know what that was. The cat I went to see if the cat was still asleep. And yes the cat and dog are still asleep well the dog was sitting on the floor scratching her or like biting her tail or whatever but the cat the cat was still sound asleep in the bed next to my fiance and that's a car going down the road. Piece of shit. But um Yeah, the uh cat was still laying next to my fiance. The dog was on the floor, but hell the dog knows better not to not to mess with the tree. Actually, in five years since me and her, this is our fifth Christmas together, in five years since we've been putting a tree up with that dog, um, she's never, never messed with the tree at all. Which I'm very surprised about because she's fucking bad. I can't believe she's gonna be five. She's gonna be five in February. By the way, me and my fiance get in an argument about that all the time. She got the dog in the February before me and her got together. She got the dog February 2006. Or 2016, I'm sorry. And me and her got together um, in June 2016. Um, we get in a fight all the time. She always says that the dog is like a year or two younger than it really is. Uh, it drives me fucking nuts. Like she doesn't. She says that she's good at math. And I know she's gonna. She's gonna watch these videos and hear me talking shit on her. But she says she's good at math, and she always messes that up. It's funny as hell. I'm not getting anything on here. It's not talking to me anymore. So I'm going to stop recording on this ghost tube app. For the time being. I'm going to upload it. and But I'm going to keep recording everything else that I can. the other day. She decided to play Wait. around. Um, I don't know how to delete. Delete that. Hello, Lord, this Wayne train. <laughs> <coughs> <coughs> 
Sorry, I'm dying. Come on, I just want to upload it. Thank you. I'm going to shut this off. <coughs> Sorry, I'm wheezing like crazy. I don't know why. Let me hit my inhaler. Oh, man. It's the exact reason right there why I don't want to stop recording because every once in a while I notice that whenever something is going to happen, uh, I always start wheezing a little bit. So, it's like a heavy SPN. Oh my god. Yes, I was forced to watch that movie Mean Girls, okay? That's like the funniest part of the whole movie. The rest of the movie sucks. My fiance loves that movie, so. Anyways, I'm gonna turn this on. I'm gonna start answering questions or asking questions, see if I get answers. Alright, so I have the recorder in the middle of the room. It's just laying there. You can come talk to it. Actually, you know what? For shits and giggles, I'll even put it on the Ouija board. So you can maybe come through it a little bit better. Um, what is your name? Was that you that slammed my doors? Why did you slam my doors? Are you upset about something? Did you just want attention or something? Is that you that was messing with my tree? Do you want or have to tell me something? So my digital recorder just died and it literally just had full batteries on it. Like the batteries were legit brand new. Okay. Um, let me change the batteries in here. That's really fucking weird. I don't understand it. Brand new batteries and they died. 